Hey, Tom Donnie here for Dodge Iowa. Want to talk about the front pulley setup on a Saab three cylinder two stroke. This is a pulley that I painted up, and you can see I've not painted where the seal rides. You've got your seal in the aluminum cup back here, and we don't want to paint this area here. I see that painted by a lot of people, and that should be a mirror finish, nice and shiny. The other thing I don't want to paint is right here. I wrote don't cut because this was one we're using for an example. We're making these new GT rings now. They're a larger diameter, but we'll talk about another video. But I don't paint here, and I don't paint here where this rubber ring has to ride. That's your vibration part, and that should be able to, vi be able to move. You know, this whole ring should move slightly, so don't paint that. I want to look at this snap ring. The snap ring always pops out on these little guys. And what I do is I silicone them in. I just take some black silicone or blue silicone, whatever hell color you want to use. Um, and I'll dab it in around the groove here with the snap ring firmly in place. I clean it first with brake clean or something like that. Um, you know, silicone's a great product if you've got a really clean surface and if you allow it time to set. Two, two key elements there. Too many people put silicone on and put oil in and stuff right away. 24 hours curing at room temp longer if it's colder so keep that in mind i've seen silicone weeks later and uh, zero in you know like 32 degrees fahrenheit and it's still not set up so let's smear that silicone around and i'll just take a little screwdriver here and i'll just work it in so i've got i've got the snap ring all covered and if you've got that snap ring covered with silicone that thing is not going to come out and the next time you need to rebuild the engine or pop this aluminum cover out, this snap ring will come out because it is silicone. I just re-clean it and do it again. My Bonneville engine, I've had that thing apart probably 50 times. Every time I just re-silicone it and away we go. So that's a quick, easy way. I know some guys have used new snap rings. Um, I've tried playing with different snap rings, but this seems to be the quickest, easiest way to keep your snap rings in. And again, I've never seen one pop out. So that's any of your three-cylinder two-strokes to solve your popping snap ring problem because what happens is when you take your pulley assembly off on so many of them the snap ring will be laying in there and then of course the cup has worked its way out and everything's loose inside and on a uh, non-injected engine this outer aluminum cup holds the front seal to the crankshaft in so if, if that front seal moves then you're going to lose crankcase um, power on number one cylinder and foul plugs that kind of problem think you got a bad motor and all you got is a, a retaining cup that popped out of place so quick easy way to do that this is tom donnie from port dodge iowa have a safe day sobbing